Hello and welcome back to my channel with Reza Z. Today I'm going to talk about the potential benefit of the fishing uh, as a practice of the mindfulness um, for improving our mental health and our health in general. Uh, mental health in, uh, is one of the largest burden in Australia and globally. In Australia, it has estimated uh, two in five people aged between 16 to 85 have experienced some mental disorder during their life. With increasing of the mental problem in our society, there is the question, what is the best way and solution to overcome those issues? Is that medication? Is that meditation or a, a multiple of things we can do? I personally find um, mindfulness uh, has been very good practice for my mental health and well-being. Basically, mindfulness is practicing of bringing our attention to the present without judgmental way. Uh, there are many studies that show the benefit of the mindfulness uh, for mental health, such as uh, reducing stress and anxiety, uh, improve our focus and concentration, uh, improve our cognitive conditions, um, helps us with self-compassion and self-care, as well as in general helps reduce our stress and our improve our health and mental health and our health in general. Mindfulness can be practiced in many ways, such as doing yoga, uh, breathing exercise, listening to music, painting, walking in the nature, and many other things. But today I want to discuss how fishing at least helps me and I believe some of the people which I know help them with the mindfulness and their mental health and well-being. Now I want to share with you why I think uh, fishing for people just like me can provide a sort of mindfulness and what kind of the benefit they potentially have for me and people who want to try that kind of practice of fishing as a mindfulness and improving the mental and health overall. Um, which is basically 10 points and we're going together one by one. The first point I believe is bring us close to nature. When you go to fishing, you are in the nice places usually, is a water, um, is a river or ocean or lake and it's usually, it's a nice place. There are a lot of birds, the uh, sound of the water and a lot of life around us and all of those aspects help us to get closer to nature. There are many studies keep coming up, the benefit of the being close to nature and spending some time with the nature is going to help us on mental health and well-being and this is not exception. I here I attach some of the, my latest adventure which I did my with good friend Vince. We which went for fishing you know last week and you can see what I'm talking about. Fishing help you focus in present. When you do fishing, if you haven't done fishing, it requires a lot of things to think about. Uh, you have to think about tight, you can look at the wind, you have to think about um, basically what time it is, uh, then you know, temperature, what kind of jacket you're gonna, sun cream you have to put on, then you have to think what bait you're gonna uh, use, what kind of uh, set you're gonna use, and, uh, and then when you finally uh, about to catching the fish, you have to fill the rod, fill the line, and all of those little aspects 
force you to concentrate about nothing except fishing before you're really in the present moment and not so many activity actually providing that unique uh, things and you can see it in that footage which you know put it up there and you can see how we, we are involved uh, Vince and I myself involved in those kind of activity if you haven't done fishing fishing require a lot of patience usually when you go fishing you don't catch fish straight away and sometimes you catch none then understanding of having no expectation and enjoying the moment it's skills you learn through the fishing and those skills is quite valuable especially when you have dealing with the teenagers to just have no expectation and to try to live in the moment it's to remove the stress and the distraction these days um, phone uh, internet uh, and uh, many things distract us and stress us constantly when you are fishing usually you are in the remote places you can't answer the phone or watch your phone because you have to concentrate in a lot of activity which I discussed before before you that to remove those distractions and stress level during the fishing which is great beneficial for our health and mindfulness as well bring a purpose it's a kind of activity which the purpose of this activity is just not being the present actually we try to catch a fish therefore we have to think about a lot of things which are discussed such as what kind of a bait i use did i, did I have any bite should i pull the uh, check uh, the belly uh, should i try another area and many many other things we have to think all of those little things they gave us purpose and they bring us closer to ourselves and what's our body and what's happening around us and that is kind of effect which is going to help us mentally and promote our mental health as well fishing they bring a sort of a stillness today life we are constantly jumping from one task to one other task we multitasking and it's kind of become our uh, look like we have to do always you know multitasking which is not generally speaking good for our mental health during the fishing however because we have to think about one you know we do a lot of little job and that's focus us to one task which is basically fishing and reduce the chance of our distraction of that main task to do other things which is very different than, for example, if you're walking in park or sitting, watching the birds and stuff, you may be distracted and you know think about other stuff. But in the fishing, because you have to proactively check your line, check the you know, bait, rebait, or you know just add something or change the angle of your rod or you know stuff we have to do. It's it's constantly make you focus in one task and you learn the stillness and being present which is exactly what we want to be achieve fishing is a form of the exercise it's not heavy exercise however it can be heavy exercise depends you know if you go to rough uh, water or you know try to catch in a big fish they can be quite actually physical as well However, generally speaking, even if you go to very calm water or just uh, from bank of the river, it's still you know casting, standing, you know just baiting and pulling the fish. You know it's a good exercise, and there are a lot of benefit of the being physically active can improve our mental and physical health through improving our. Uh, endorphin and reducing our cortisol which is going to be beneficial as well fishing can help uh, self care and self compassion for example if you organize for yourself every month I'm going to do one you know fishing um, adventure by doing this actually you self prioritize your self um, care and self compassion 
uh, and through that actually you improve your mental and physical health as my mom always says if you look after yourself first and you be 100% you will be useful to people around yourself if you are not 100% you can not only you use not useful to yourself you can help anyone else as well fishing a lot of times can connect you with your friend which or your family which you don't see that often that's excuse to bring you together and make those experience of the being out and being present which you share it with someone which they can multiple effect and improve your you know pleasure and endorphin much in a higher level therefore you have better experience just like experience which I had with my friend Vincent that trip the 10 benefit which I'm going to discuss with you it's the if you catch fish and you get lucky or catch few fish and you get even more lucky you can enjoy eating and cooking those fish mindfully and appreciate your effort and hopefully your family and friend as well in the end I want to just say fishing it's not obviously for everyone uh, the things which interest some people maybe be uh, boring or uh, not that attractive to other people uh, there is no uh, perfect activity therefore I'll just this example of what I find and I believe a lot of people similar to myself find useful but if you haven't tried fishing I encourage you just have a try uh, ideally go with someone done fishing before uh, because if you get lucky and catch one fish and uh, the feel of the bite and you know the pull the fish and hopefully you catch nice fish and you can eat it it uh, can hook you to that um, basically practicing of uh, getting close to nature and spending uh, allocating some of your time and through that improve your mental health and well-being therefore if you have really some um, concern with your mental health your best bet is go and talk to professional and doctors and hopefully they can help you uh, with uh, different suggestion and advice but if you have um, you know just like most of us you have sometimes um, uh, these days we all have uh, a lot of stress and anxiety is coming in our way but by practicing you know the activity of as I mentioned uh, mindfulness and in a regular basis such as going fishing can help some of the uh, people as well just like myself and if you haven't done fishing I encourage you just have a try uh, and hopefully you enjoy it if not um, you know try something else you know which I hope you like I hope you enjoy watching this video and are looking uh, forward to see your comment and suggestions uh, if you like to see those material please subscribe otherwise I'll see you all next week thank you very much see you later